Now look at this liul piu. So as you see, l sound is always pronounced, and this p sound will regain its value when the letter is followed by a vowel. Look at this example. This is yo here yo, and this is pronounced as tol tol. So we pronounce this like yo tol. Now look at this example. This one is jal when pronounced alone. Jal. And this letter is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So liaison or linking occurs and pub moves to the next letter. So this un becomes pun. Jalbun. Jalbun. And this one is dolbun. Dolbun. Now, lyrics number 8 is from the song Miniskirt by AOA. 짧은 치마를 입고 짧은 치마를 입고 Let's watch the video first. This part 짧은 치마를 입고 One more time. 짧은 치마를 입고 This letter is pronounced as 짤 in isolation, but it is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So the hidden p sound moves to the next letter, and 은 becomes 분. So this is pronounced as 짧은 짧은 Let's watch the video again. 짧은. One more time. 짧은 치마를 입고. Look at the next one. 리을 티읍. 리을 티읍. Look at the examples. This one is pronounced as 할 in isolation. But it is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So linking or liaison occurs and t moves to the next letter. So u becomes t. So this is pronounced like haltumyo. Haltumyo. Lyrics number nine is from the song Laura by Next. Next is the name of a rock group. Sangcho Wider Haltumyo. 상처 위를 핥으며 Let's listen to the song first. 상처 위를 핥으며 One more time. 상처 위를 핥으며 So this letter is pronounced as 할 in isolation, but it is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So liaison or linking occurs and then the hidden t sound, t sound moves to the next letter. So this u becomes t, t. So this is pronounced as 할트며, 할트며. Let's listen again. 상처 위를 할트며. One more time. 상처 위를 핥으며 Let's move to the next one. 리을 히읗 Look at the examples. This one is pronounced as 뚤 in isolation. And the next letter starts with a consonant, not a vowel. And in this case, the sound 히읗, H, is combined with the consonant 기어 and becomes Q, K sound. It's called aspiration. And I'll also tell you this later. So, ko becomes ko. Dul ko. Dul ko. Lyrics number 10 is from the song Call Me Baby by EXO. 나를 한순간 뚫고 가. 뚫고 가. Let's watch the video first. 나를 한순간 뚫고 가. 뚫고 가. One more time. 나를 한순간 뚫고 가. 뚫고 가. 
So this letter is pronounced as dur in isolation and is followed by a consonant of the next letter, kyok. So the hidden hyuk sound, H sound, is combined with the consonant kyok of this letter and it becomes kyuk, K sound. So ko becomes ko. So this is pronounced as dur ko. Dur ko. Let's watch the video again. 나를 한순간 뚫고가 One more time 나를 한순간 뚫고가 나를 한순간 뚫고가 나는 것들은 만나 그간의 진짜를 봐봐 Call me baby Call me baby Now we only have four left These three double final consonants are different from the other ones Only in these three cases the second consonant is important 기억 of 리을 기억 미음 of 리을 미음 피읍 of 리을 피읍 So look at this romanization symbol. Now L is in the parenthesis and the 기억 sound G is out the parenthesis. Look at the example. We pronounce this letter as 흑 like this. The sound of 리을 L sound is hidden. Now look at this example. When this letter is pronounced alone, it is pronounced as pak. Pak. Near sound is still hidden. But when this letter is used with other letter, then the hidden real sound gains its value. So it is pronounced as pal. Pal. So we pronounce this like palke. Palke. And look at this example. We pronounce this word as Tak in isolation, tak. Only kyok sound is pronounced, but it is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So in this case, the hidden real sound regains its value. So it is pronounced as tal. And then the kyok of this real kyok shifts to the next letter. So this e becomes ki. And the hidden real sound regains its value. So it is pronounced as Talki. Talki. Interesting, isn't it? Maybe confusing. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. Lyrics number six is from the song Violetta by Eyes One. Palke pichi dajana. Palke pichi dajana. Let's watch the video first. Palke pichi. Najana. One more time. Palke. Pichi. Najana. This letter is pronounced as pak in isolation. But when this letter is used together with another letter, then the hidden real sound regains its value. So it is pronounced as pal. And I also think that you better memorize this pronunciation. Palke. Palke. Pichi. Da. This one is pronounced as chan in isolation. And this letter is followed by a vowel of the next letter. And hit is dropped. And then the remaining dun moves to the next letter. So a becomes na. So this is pronounced like chana. Dajana. Palke pichi dajana. Let's watch the video again. 밝게 빛이 나잖아 One more time 밝게 빛이 나잖아 밝게 빛이 나잖아 Let's move to the next one 리을 미음 Look at the example We pronounce this word as 삼 삼. The sound of 리을 is hidden But look at this this sam is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So, bium of liul bium shifts to the next letter. So, this un becomes mun. And the hidden liul sound regains its value. So, it is pronounced as sal mun. Sal mun. Lyrics number seven is from the song Forever Young by Blackpink. 후회 없는 젊음이 타오르게 
젊음이 타오르게. So this is 젊음. Let's watch the video first. 후회 없는, 후회 없는 this part. 젊음이, 젊음이. One more time. 젊음이, 젊음이 타오르게. 타오르게. So 후회 없는. This letter is pronounced as 점 in isolation. But it is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So the sound mium shifts to the next letter and hidden real sound regains its value. So it is pronounced as 젊음. 젊음. 후회 없는 젊음이 타오르게. Let's watch the video again. 후회 없는, 후회 없는 젊음이. 젊음이. One more time. 젊음이 타오르게. 젊음이 타오르게. Now let's look at the next one. 리을 피읍. As I said, 피읍 sound. P is important. And look at the example. We pronounce this word as 읍다. 읍다. This letter starts with the consonant. Not a vowel, but as the case is above, when this letter is followed by a vowel, then the same phenomenon occurs. So these three cases are different from the others. So maybe memorizing these three cases is not a bad idea, but how? All of them start with lir, and this one is kio, miyum, piu. I run the other YouTube channel for learners of English, and I use the title like. 구문팝, 구문팝. So 기억 as in 구, 미음 as in 문, 피읍 as in 팝, 구문팝. Or if there's any other way you can think of, try it to memorize this. Now this is the final one, 피읍 시옷. The sound 피, 피읍 is important. Look at this example. This letter is pronounced as 갑. In isolation, kap, the sound of shiot s is hidden. But look at this example. This kap is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So the hidden shiot moves to the next letter, and this e becomes shi. It is tensified somehow. So this is pronounced as kap shia. Lyrics number eleven is from the song Kokoba by EXO. 참을 수가 없어 빠져가 참을 수가 없어 Let's watch the video first. 참을 수가, 참을 수가 없어. 없어 One more time. 참을 수가, 없어. 참을 수가 없어 So this letter is pronounced as up in isolation. Up. And it is followed by a vowel of the next letter. So liaison or linking occurs, and then the hidden show sound, S sound, moves to the next letter, and all becomes so. And then the sound is somehow tensified. So this is pronounced as opso. Opso. Let's watch the video again. 참을 수가, 참을 수가 없어. 없어. One more time. 참을 수가 없어. 빠져가, yeah. 잠을 수가 없어 빠져가 예예 yeah, yeah. Alright, we checked out double final consonants in this video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support and subscription. Bye bye.